I have a Samsung Galaxy Z Flip here. I'm going to show you how to use the wireless power share. And we're going to go ahead and test drive these phones here. Even this phone here has a case on it, okay? So very, very simple. So what you're going to do is if you just swipe down and then with that horizontal line is right there, swipe down again, and then you'll see wireless power share here, okay? So now if you just tap and hold, this will bring you into the settings. And you can see down here, by default, it's set to 30%. So once your phone, your uh, Z Flip goes down to 30%, it's not going to be able to wirelessly charge anymore. But you can always change this number as well as you, if you wish. Anyways, let's go ahead and let's wirelessly charge some of these phones here. So let me just go down. And now I'm just going to go ahead and just tap on this. Okay. Now you get this ready right here. Now the thing is we can charge it having the phone open or closed, okay? For example, we can leave it open, and it's the bottom part here. So for example, let me put this phone on top of here. This is a Samsung Galaxy S20, by the way. Yeah, no problem, it's charging, okay? We can also close it like that, and let's charge another phone. This is a Samsung Galaxy S9 here. Let's pop that on here. A little bit slippery though, as you can see. Anyway, that charges no problem. How about an iPhone XS Max, big phone? Let's pop that on here. Let's see if that charges. Oh, let me break it down a little bit more. There we go. It charges no problem. Now let's go ahead and charge a iPhone 11 Pro Max with a thick case on it. Let's see what happens. No problem. And of course, if you have a case on it, it doesn't slide um, as much as like these other phones. Okay, these other phones kind of like slide down. Anyways, pretty simple to do. And once you have it off for a little while, it'll automatically uh, switch off the uh, PowerShare mode. So pretty much it.